All right, I've got huge news. I've just heard that HERS has released a revolutionary new chip brand. Uh, I, I'm sure it's gonna be basic. I mean, what, what could really be new? Come on! Hey there, and welcome back to Snackable. So today on Snackable, as you see, we have a bunch of chips to try. Uh, it's from a new brand through HERS called Sandwich Chips which I just love. I think that's a fantastic name. Like, I, every time I see it, the branding on this gets a 10 out of 10 in my mind just because the, the, the name is interesting, all the flavors are interesting, um, and just the look of them really feels brand new. It, it doesn't feel like something that hers always does, which is nice. I, I like the little change. But, you know, I, I'm not in love with hers. I wanna try the chips. But we have sweet onion, mustard, We've got spicy pickle, and we've got ketchup, which is a favorite of my mom's. Um, as much as I love ketchup, I've never been a fan of ketchup chips, but we're gonna give them another try. It's been 10 years since I've tried them, so. Now all of these bags cost $2.99. Um, it's a decent size, uh, two and three eight ounce. Um, so it's pretty normal for a bag of chips. And I think these are made to go with the specific food that is on the actual front. So like the ketchup chips, these are meant to be put on a burger. The spicy pickle, that's meant to be put on like a hoagie from Wawa. Um, this one's actually a Wawa exclusive. Um, let's see, the mustard one looks like it's supposed to go on a like ham and Swiss sandwich, which a huge fan of mustard. I don't think I've given it a, a, a real like shot, but it's there. And sweet onion is supposed to go on a chicken sandwich, it looks like. Yeah, that looks like a chicken sandwich, right? Sure, why not? Um, the mustard is what I'm most interested in because I'm not a mustard fan. If you can get me to like that chip, then it's a gold mine. Um, so I'm, I'm wondering if all four of these are going to be snackable. I mean, just pure numbers something has to not be snackable here. It could be the spicy pickle. I have favorably rated pickle chips, um, but that's mostly because they don't really taste like pickle. They taste more like vinegar when I'm doing that. So we'll see. Um, and it hasn't been like, oh, that's a pickle. So we'll see. I think I should probably try the pickle first though, just to be fair, because if I tried the other ones, I'm like, oh, this isn't a good set. So that's not fair. And I'm gonna try it first, so. Huh, yeah, I mean, smells like dill pickle. All right, here we go. Wow. This is really good. Holy crap. So the whole point of these chips is basically you put these on a sandwich and they will make it better. But the chips have to be good to begin with because now they're not just a condiment, now they're a main attraction to the actual sandwich. Um, and these might be some of the best chips I've ever had, uh, which is surprising because I hate pickles. Um, the spiciness of it, it's there, it's very subtle, it's nice, it's beautiful. Um, there's so much flavor on these chips. Uh, they're not like vinegar chips at all. You definitely, it smells like vinegar chips, but like even the vinegar is very like, slight and hinted and the pickle flavor is very forward so it's and it's not bad it's weird how good these are this is a nine out of ten if you put these on like an italian sandwich that's that's a home run like absolutely home run nine out of ten well done spicy pickle i you know i didn't believe in you but i was wrong Next, we're gonna go with mustard because I don't believe in mustard either. So who knows, I could be surprised again. Hmm, not really too much of a smell. These are definitely a little more yellow uh, than, you know, chips that we've seen before. They're, yeah, look at that, that's definitely yellow. Um, yeah, I don't know. Doesn't really smell like mustard, doesn't really smell like anything, um, except like maybe a chip, but all right, let's, let's go. Wow, that is mustard. The mustard taste is so prevalent. Um, and I hate mustard and I don't hate this. What is going on? Are any of these chips going to be bad? Like mustard, you know, the pickles were, were, were 
great. Now the mustard, I thought I wouldn't believe in that, and it's it's so good. The seasoning is all there. I'm not a huge fan of mustard, but like the flavor is so prevalent of not only the mustard, but just all around trying to make it a good chip that it's actually like irritating because sometimes you want to be like, oh, this could have been a little better. It's like, no, that that's perfect just the way it is. Not a 10 out of 10, not a nine out of 10. It is a seven out of 10. If you put that on a ham and Swiss sandwich, if you like mustard on those, like, oh, so good. Really, just it. You don't even need to put mustard on it because it has the flavor of the mustard right there. Because we just did mustard, let's just do ketchup. It's only right. Huh. Whoa, whoa. That is such a strong smell coming out of there. What is that? It almost smells like a cookie, almost. Is it, it could be the paprika, I guess. I don't know what it is. And these are some of the darkest chips I have ever seen in my life. Look at that freaking chip. There's like a full bottle of ketchup on this chip. What do you, you're supposed to put these on a burger. I'm I'm nervous. I've I, you know I've had hot chips that were lighter than this, and they scared me. This one really scares me because I don't want it to be too much. I love ketchup, and I don't want it to ruin it for me. So, here we go. Oh my gosh, what is that? What is that flavor? Oh my gosh, I don't know. I have no idea. So I wondered if they were gonna have a bad chip and boom, there it was. Um, I mean, that just straight up doesn't taste like ketchup. I don't know exactly what they did or what's on this. I, I still can't put my finger on. I've looked at this and I just can't figure it out. I gotta give them a four. I mean, these are just egregious. They're just way too much. You put these on a burger and they're gonna take everything away that's on the burger. The onion, the tomato, the burger itself even. It's just too much. I don't know what they were trying to do here. Yeah, ketchup chips, they're relatively popular, but it's just too much. So I'm sorry for... So I said something was gonna be unstackable and it just happened to be this. And lastly, we have sweet onion. And this is meant to be put on sort of like a chicken sandwich, it looks like, like a grilled chicken sandwich, like a club. Yeah, super sweet, super sweet smelling, just like a freaking onion. It smells like there's an onion in this bag. So that's intriguing. I'm wondering if this is gonna be good. It's definitely gonna be sweet, so we'll have to see. All right, nice nice uh, seasoned chip, as per all the rest of them. <laughs> Ketchup was too much, but all right, let's see how these are. Mm. Whoa. That was weird. Yeah, did the same thing again. Those are really, really good. And I think that they would add quite a bit to a sandwich, possibly too much salt. Um, unless it's the sweetness that I, that's hitting me. So when you chew them, you know, you taste everything right away and it's like, oh, this is nice. It, you know, I taste the onion, sweet onion and everything. But then when you swallow, all the seasoning hits like the back of your throat at once and it's, it is fantastic, but it's a lot of salt. So if you're not a fan of salt, watch out. Um, and it hits you sort of all at once and you're sort of like taken aback by it. It's a lot. But it is fantastic. I would love that on a, a chicken sandwich or something like that. That would be really, really nice. Um, and you wouldn't really need to put any onion on. I would put that honestly at an eight. I think, it, I think it's really, really good. If you don't like salt, you're not gonna like it as much. Um, but that getting that sweet onion flavor in a chip is something that hasn't happened before and they nailed it. So that's all the chips that we have for you. The, the favorite with a nine is the spicy pickle. Well done. Um, then with an eight, we got the sweet onion. <laughs> Almost dropped it. And ironically with a seven, mustard. And finally with a four, ketchup. Just 
really uh, sad. I, I think I need to do the regular ketchup chips and see if they are, because this is this is sandwich chips, so it's different. But uh, just odd. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please try them out for yourself. Tell me which one you enjoy the best. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit that like button, subscribe, and comment down below what I should be trying next. Plenty of stuff coming out there. I have a whole bunch of snackable stuff in my fridge, and I'm in my apartment. Uh, that Titanic will be built within the next few weeks, and it's going to be there, and it's going to look awesome. It's going to be a great back display thing, and I'm going to love it. So hope you guys enjoy it too. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I guess we'll have to see what we're eating next time. Bye.